Okay, we're back again, this time making a marinated goat cheese with herbs and spices. I really, really love this recipe. Go to our bio for the ingredients. You'll absolutely love it. Don't forget to wash your hands first. And then just slice the bread and get it in the oven so it can get toasted as you're preparing the goat cheese. Line it up in the baking sheet and then put it in the oven. Crush your garlic and your spices and don't forget that orange zest. Now it's time for your frying pan, add your olive oil, and then mix in all of your herbs and spices. And you're going to want to simmer on low heat. This was a little crazy for me. It really got brown quickly, probably faster than it should have. And some of it, as you can see, is a little too brown, but that's fine. It didn't affect the taste. Then crumble up the goat cheese and then put over all the herbs and spices with the olive oil and look how good, minus the little black spots, which I couldn't taste. Then you're gonna take out your bread from the oven and you're gonna line it up on a tray. This is how I served it. And you're gonna put on every single crostini bread, the olive oil with the goat cheese. And you're gonna just repeat the process until they're all done. Does not look so good, but guys, look how good that is. A work of art, yum. Enjoy.